Hey, it's Eric Crawford at Cardinal Stadium. Scott Satterfield has just finished his regular Tuesday news conference. He talked for 20 some minutes, but you don't need to take 20 minutes. We're going to give you the key highlights of what he said right here. He started with an injury report after Friday's loss to Florida State before Saturday's game at South Florida. The key injury, the loss of wide receiver D Wiggins for the rest of the season. Tyon's back this week. Um, you know, he was a game time decision and decided not to play him, but he's back this week, so should be full go. Trevor Reed went down, second drive. Um, hopefully he's back today. Um, I think he'll be able to go to practice today. Caleb Chandler didn't play in the second half of the game. Um, hopefully he's back today as well. Just met with our trainer. Um, so I think both of those guys are back. Uh, Wiggins, um, unfortunately, Wiggins is going to have to have surgery. Um, this week uh, on, on, a, on his foot, on his toe. Um, and so we'll probably miss the rest of the season. Um, it's probably going to be a four to five month recovery um, on, his, on his injury, which is a shame. He, you know, I feel like he was really hitting, getting ready to hit his stride. Um, you know, he's a fast receiver for us, big, big receiver. So now other guys are going to have to step up um, in, in that role for losing him. We were already a little bit thin there anyway. Um, but I hate that for Wiggins. Um, great kid, great attitude, plays hard, you know, so losing him. Um, trying to thank anybody else that's back. I think everybody else is, is good to go. Uh, we had a couple guys get dinged and, you know, missed a few plays here there. Yaya, Ashton, um, but, but they, should be, they should be good to go as well. Well, Louisville passing offense is producing plenty of yards, but has had only one touchdown pass all season. WDRB's Rick Bozich asked Scott Satterfield about that on Tuesday. Here's his response. Well, I mean, I, I thought we threw the ball pretty good the other night. Um, I thought, you know, completion percentage was nice. Um, threw for whatever we threw, you know, I don't know how many yards, 250. But, um, you know, yeah, obviously we'd like to get in the end zone throwing the ball. Um, you know, we just need to score. I don't, I don't care how we score, if it's running or throwing, it doesn't really matter to me. Um, you know, I think, um, you know, you, you would like to see more of the, some more touchdown passes. And, and the one thing that we haven't gotten is like the, the touchdown, the longer touchdown pass, you know, the big play, uh, that, that's what I'd like to see more of. I think when you get in the red zone, I don't really care how we score. We just got to score. But, but some of the, the longer touchdown passes that we've had, you know, would be nice to be able to get some of those dialed back up. We've talked a lot about Louisville in close games, and my question to Satterfield on Tuesday was, is there something mentally with his team that's not happening in some of these close losses or the plays just not getting made? Here's what the coach had to say. Well, yeah, I mean, we had a great opportunities Friday night, um, you know, really on both sides of the ball, offensively and defensively. And, you know, we lose contain two times in the game, and they end up scoring two touchdowns on the, the very next play. And, uh, you know, so, you know, offensively, even after everything happened in the game, you know, we were driving the last drive there. Um, we drop a pass on the sideline that could potentially could have went and scored. You go get that, everybody's happy, you know, and all this stuff doesn't even matter. Um, you know, it's just, you just haven't, you have to make a play somewhere along the way. And, um, and there's so many of them that, that could have happened. I mean, I, I think about um, before we fumbled in the red zone, the play right before that, we had an opportunity to throw a touchdown pass and we didn't throw it. And, you know, so it's just there's, there's certain plays where you got to be able to make those plays. Um, and you got to make one more than the other team. Florida State made one more than we did. And, um, you know, it was a very even game. And you come down to fourth quarter, we, they held us to a field goal. They, they got a touchdown. There's the four points. Um, uh, you know, so it's basically just coming down to finding those plays and, and, and making them. You just never know when, when they're going to happen. You can read more about Satterfield's comments and Louisville football as it prepares for a Saturday game against South Florida at WDRB.com. For WDRB Sports, I'm Eric Crawford.